Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing well. This is episode number 15 and we are going to be looking at our weekly signings guys in today's episode. So without any further ado, let's actually have a look at the squad we have built so far and then we'll head over to the mystery signing chapter and we'll get the player that we actually want to build the squad we are actually building and hopefully you guys will also get a view of which player is what, how it is, whether it's good or not, what player to take for your... Uh, squad that you're building if you have just started playing this wonderful game so without any further ado actually let us get into the squad uh, this is the mystery signing squad we have been built uh, building so far uh, we are playing 433 attack actually i played with this squad a lot i played actually head to head and uh, versus attack and the squad is actually surprisingly really good and i am actually impressed with the squad i'm building only the center midfield position michael moreno is one part i would like to increase but apart from that it's a nice squad you know 90 overall squad we need a good goalie and a center back guys if we get a good goalie and center back i think we will be gucci for the uh, you know building process of the team hopefully we'll start getting 91 rated soon now let us get to the mystery signing squad so many events are going on right now my head is spinning i don't know what event to do i don't know if i played the event or i missed out in a particular day because so many things are going on so make sure you guys get into the grind as well now i'm pretty sure you guys would have opened all these uh you know players and you guys know what player it is maybe some of you guys even uh, uh took the player which you wanted you know selected player a or player b now those who haven't done this yet make sure you guys Watch till the end of the video so that you guys can get a view. Oh, Simons. Zavi Simons. Cam. 90 rated Zavi Simons Cam. Actually, not a bad card. Actually, not only I love the dynamic, but look at the stats. 91 pace for a center attacking mid is always massive. He has less shooting, but he has good dribbling. 89 dribbling is not bad. His uh, finishing is 80 short part 73 long shot 78 okay so his shooting is a bit bad for a center attacking mid but he has uh three star weak foot and four star skill move he has four and a half star uh, stamina as well now the second player who is this gonna be 90 rated striker we might actually go for a 90 rated striker guys not gonna lie we right now have 89 rated uh, diego for land but we'll see who it is now every time you guys see uh what is this mystery signing video on this channel it is a purely opinionated video guys i am choosing a player based on my opinion and uh, whether i need him in my squad to build the squad or not you guys can do the same look at the squad that you are building i think many of us will be taking these cards as fodder cards but those who have started playing fc mobile and are actually looking for good positions now is the best time to start grinding this because you are getting 90 rated players and i feel like in the next three or four weeks we'll start getting 91 rated players as well and make sure you guys go to the centurions uh, uh, chapter and do the what is that game board thing it is really nice oh okay i don't know how to feel about this card 90 rated kawani is 90 rated kawani better than a 90 rated uh, zavi simons i don't know Kawani has good, he has good shooting and he has uh, good dribbling. I mean, he has decent dribbling. I wouldn't say he has good dribbling. Uh, do we actually take him? I mean, I feel like, wait, let us just actually go to the squad. Now, the Diago Forlan that we have, look at the stats. For a striker, these stats look really nice. 86 pace is not horrible. 90 shooting is nice 84 dribbling is really good so when you go to his attributes diago forlan look at his shooting he has 91 shot par 93 long shots and 91 finishing and his acceleration is 88 and 85 sprint speed his dribbling also his stats are really good now looking at uh, whom we have at cam or center mid okay we have brand Ooh, I think I'm gonna keep Brand. I feel like we're gonna go take Kawani for uh, for ourselves. So make sure you guys, you know, do all these comparisons whom you have for what position. I know many of us will be looking at these cards as fodder cards. If you want, you can choose anybody you want. That doesn't really matter. I would go for a Bundesliga Netherlands player because uh, some of the criteria he might be helpful, you know, in the future. But I would actually go for Kawani. Just because I need a 90 rated striker. I have 89 rated Diago Forlan. But his pace is... Look at the pace. 
pace is not bad his acceleration is very low but uh, i mean pace is okay i guess it's not that uh, bad but shooting if you look at his long shots he has only 77 guys which is very very low shot power is 90 positioning 92 okay finishing is 89 i guess it is fine uh dribbling is very very low he has only 76 dribbling and 81 ball control now if you are building a proper squad i would not suggest taking kawani i would definitely suggest taking uh, zavi simons but for me since i need a 90 rated striker i am gonna go for kawani edison kawani so yeah rivals blue rivals kawani is the player that we are going to be adding into our squad now just like this make sure you guys take the best player every week so that you can build a madness of a team in the future some of these 90 rated cards is actually worth putting your masheranos in don't don't sleep on some of these cards but you have to be wise on uh, uh just to just to be clear you have to be wise on whom you can put these masherano cards now if it was me i would have put my masherano cards in deong or even in grealish because these players once trained and leveled up and ranked up they can be monsters so that is one reason why I said some of your Masheranos can go into them. But save Masheranos as much as possible. I would suggest keep doing those. Um, this is one of the player. Wait. I will just go to the details so that you can see the player. This is one of the player whom you can get from those. Uh, what do you say? Centurions board thing. So make sure you guys grind all the chapters. You know you can easily get uh, crazy players out of these chapters. And I know many of us would have got Sergio Ramos 91 rated as well. Now I am getting distracted. I need to put the player in that I got. Okay, we have a full starting 11 and our subs is complete. 7 subs plus 11 starting 11 players. So yeah, let's see. Content update. What is content update right now? In the middle of the day, who gives content update? I'll be back. I'll be back. Okay, that was some kind of weird error. So yeah, as you guys can see. Kavani and Diego Forlan both have both are at their base levels both are at level 0 both are not ranked up if you if you guys want to do the comparison look at the comparison guys uh, Diego Forlan has plus 2 pace uh, he has plus 4 shooting except for physical everything else Diego Forlan is better than Kavani but we are going to do this i mean since we have a full squad i think i will give uh, Forlan as my striker because in case by mistake I play with this team and forget to select my main squad which is actually this 97 rated squad that I built and even if I don't select my Hitman Highland squad which is actually looking really good actually now we are going to be grinding out for Philip Lam but Philip Lam is going to have little less space but I don't really mind you know less space I, I feel like it's, I can just uh, you know find an exception for uh, exception for Philip Lam but yeah, this is the Hitman Hoyland squad that we have built so far. And we have completed our weekly signings as well. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope this video was of some use to you guys. Now I'll see you guys in the next one. Until then, take care guys. Stay safe, stay motivated. And keep smiling. Hope you guys like this new camera angle. It is a bit weird for me to get used to. But yeah, too much space, too much room. Makes me look like a small dot in this whole room. But yeah, bye-bye. Take care.